Hi friends, Steve Welty here, owner and broker at Good Life Property Management, here to talk about if home warranties are a good idea for your investment property. Now for your personal residence, a lot of times you buy a house to live in and they come with it. You know, not a bad, not a bad call. You, I like to ask for the cash personally because I don't believe in them, but for investment properties, they never, ever, ever make sense. And let me tell you why. So first off, in the information age, the tenant has access to all sorts of information about their rights. They leave online reviews. They share information with their friends. So gone are the days of old school landlording mentality where it's just a tenant and you know, you're, you'll fix it when your guy's available and, and things like that. To keep quality tenants, especially tenants now that are paying a high rent in San Diego, you have to service the maintenance issues very quickly. And home warranties have what I call like a 50-50 ratio. So 50% of the time it gets done in somewhat reasonable time frame and manner. And then 50% of the time it's an absolute nightmare. I could tell you some stories that are just incredible you would never believe. Now, some things to think about. Number one is the home warranties only use the bottom of the rung vendors. I'm not taking a shot at anyone personally, but they pay very little to these vendors. They may be good people, but they're not offering a great service because otherwise they wouldn't need to use go through the home warranty for business and they would have their own work. So usually the vendors are lesser quality. Number two is you're still paying a $75 service call after you buy the four, five, six, seven dollars $700 home warranty. And then also not everything is covered. So a lot of times, you know, it takes a couple days, three days to get out there and then you and then it takes another day for them to send the report to the home warranty and then you end up finding out it's not even covered after you paid the service call and the home warranty. Very frustrating. But like I alluded to earlier, the biggest reason is time. So how it works is you submit a home warranty request, it takes a day for the vendor to contact you, best case scenario, sometimes multiple days and you have to track them down. Then they'll contact the tenant and set up according to their schedule. And since they're not paid very much by the home warranty, a lot of times that's pushed out. And then they go out and then a lot of times they don't even tell anything to the tenant or the management company because they have to report it to the home warranty company and then we're waiting another day. So especially the timely repairs like fridges or air conditioning or uh, stoves, things like, you know, that type, sort of time frame just is not acceptable. And it's not acceptable if you want to keep your tenant in the property. The number one reason tenants move is that things weren't fixed in a timely manner. So the best business practice is to not use a home warranty and just use your own vendors. Few final things to think about. The reason you buy insurance is that you can't self-insure a loss. So like we all buy home insurance because God forbid if it were to burn down or some major liability, you know, it would it could put someone out of business or bankrupt them. So if your AC goes out, maybe probably one of the most expensive things that could happen um, or even like a roof issue, uh, you should be able to self-insure that repair. If you can't, then you're, you're running a risky business to begin with, uh, having the rental property and not being able to pay for or having a, a, an emergency account for your property. And then lastly, the reason home warranty companies can stay in business is because the odds are in their favor. The odds that they're going to make more money and have to fix less stuff versus their premiums means that they stay in business. So just the sheer math doesn't work in your favor. Hope I gave you some things to think about. If I can answer any questions for you or help you, help you with anything, please let me know. Make it a great day.